What is big data? People talk about petabytes and exabytes and a jumbo jet crossing the Atlantic, you know, can store up to a gazillion bytes of information, but when does small data become big data? Is there a point, you know, where an extra byte is added and then all of a sudden it becomes big data? Everyone talks a lot about big data, but do they really understand what it is? Let's take a standard database, okay? So we've got tables in there. Uh, within those tables, uh, we have a sales table, orders table, and we have a sale and a, a um, customers table. <clears throat> and that's quite structured and it's easy to query and easy to get information out of. But what big data is, is like taking loads and loads of data and putting it into a huge unstructured bucket. So we've got all that data in there, in that bucket, and what we want to be able to do is to read patterns within that data. So a little bit like um, when a um, fortune teller reads your tea leaves, but a, just a little bit scientific. So the kind of patterns we're going to want to see is, um, for example, when all my customers went into a, uh, they, when I brought something, they bought a red shirt and they, they all brought blue shirts. It's nothing precise, it's nothing detailed, but it gives you a trend and gives you a pattern against that. Or maybe um, when we did a product launch, everyone in South Wales um, tweeted that it, was, um, that it was good. So what big data really is, is all about patterns and all about being able to try to understand unstructured data. But really and truly, whether it's big data or small data, just use it. You never know what you might discover.